How do you be a godly person in an ungodly situation? When everything inside you wants to retaliate, wants to, you know, this is wrong. To this you were called. Because Christ suffered for you, leaving you an example that you should follow in his steps. He committed no sin and no deceit was found in his mouth. When they hurled their insults at him, he did not retaliate. When he suffered, he made no threats. Instead, he entrusted himself to him who judges justly. Jesus knows the situation you're in. It's not caught him by surprise. And when he calls you to run the play of submission, he has the end in mind. He knows the bigger games afoot. And he says, I know the situation you're going through is hard and it's tough and it hurts and it's not right and it's unjust. I will reward you. He Himself bore our sins in His body on the cross so that we might die to sins and live for righteousness. By His wounds you have been healed. For you were like sheep going astray, but now you have returned to the shepherd and overseer of your souls. Our ultimate example, we live as free slaves, submitting, doing good, showing proper respect, even in unjust suffering because of Jesus. 